There appears to be. The clerk will call the roll. Mr. Alexander. Ms. Collins, Mr. Coons, Mr. Cornyn, Ms. Cortez Masto, Mr. Cotton, Mr. Kramer, Ms. Smith. Ms. Stabenow, Rish, Roberts, Rosen, Rounds, Rubio, Sanders, Sass, Schatz, Schumer, Scott of Florida, Scott of South Carolina, Shaheen, Shelby, Cinema, Smith, Stabenow, Sullivan, Tester, Tillis, Van Hollen, Warner, Warren, Whitehouse, Wicker, Wyden, Young, no senator voted in the negative. On this vote, the yeas are 96, the nays are zero. The 60 vote, vote threshold having been achieved, the bill is passed. Proud to announce tonight not a single senator voted against this $2 trillion rescue bill to save American individuals, small businesses, large businesses, and to provide considerable funding for the health care workers and the scientists and the doctors and others who are trying to solve this pandemic. So I think if I were writing your headline, I'd say the Senate has pivoted from one of the most contentious partisan periods in the nation's history to passing this rescue package 100 to nothing, all in one quarter of this year, from arguably the most partisan, divisive thing you could possibly do to coming together entirely a hundred of us to meet this challenge I think says a lot about the United States Senate as an institution, our willingness to put aside our differences and to do something really significant for the country. breath. And so this is a good ending. The twists and turns were enormous. There were some down moments, but as you know, those of you who kept asking me, are we going to get a bill? I always had faith we would because America and the American people demanded it. I, t I said on the floor, this illness is so, so different and difficult. And so when we passed this bill on the floor of the Senate. We didn't hug each other. We just waved from a distance. <laughs>